standing in the water of the Pearl River where divers spent 18 hours looking for the body of a Clinton man. If you look over there where there are no rocks, you can see that's where they found the man, where he was last seen after he swam away from his group of friends. Now, where I'm standing is where they brought the body ashore. Obviously, a lot of emotion coming out of his family and friends. And tonight, they're asking people to please be careful in the Pearl River so this doesn't happen again. The search began at about 5 o'clock Sunday evening when a group of young adults realized one of them, 24-year-old Johnny Evans, was missing. We was in the, um, in the shallow part of the river and he was, he was walking up or whatever. It was like the way he was walking, you know, I was looking like, why is he walking up there like that? And we looked down and looked back up and we just didn't see him no more. Witnesses across the river reportedly saw the man and called out to him, warning him of a nearby alligator. Seconds later, they told police they saw both the man and alligator go underwater and never come back up. As the clock ran down, the rescue mission for the man last seen here turned into a recovery mission for a possible drowned body. At about 11 a.m., divers found it. Tears run down the cheeks as roommates stand in the hot sun, remembering their friend. One of his roommates talked to him right before he left for the river. He, he thanked me for being in his life. Um, all the time that I've been there for him, the last thing he said was, well, I'm a holler to him. It's clear, regardless of how Evans died, he lived in a way that left his family like this. And his roommate warning other Pearl River swimmers to be careful. Keep a close eye. Make sure you stay together. You know, don't go to, you know what I'm saying, to the deep end part. Just stay like in the shallow part where it's no past your ankles and just be careful. Initial witness accounts led police to believe the man was attacked by an alligator, but after the initial autopsy report, police have ruled that out. Reporting from the Pearl River in Jackson, I'm Crystal Hilliard, 16 WAPT News.